Can you make sure there's hair in the front, please? Yes. Thank you. Hey, you guys. It's Alexis from Till, and these are my top 10 essentials. So I'm our director of operations. I help to keep us as organized as I possibly can. Uh, grew up in uh, Newbury Park, which is in Ventura County. Shout out to the five uh, for everyone who knows that, that side of town. Um, grew up in a pretty like normal household. Uh, I've really worked in operations my whole life, but absolutely obsessed with sneakers. And so, so happy I can kind of bridge those two worlds together. Okay, so my first essential item is coffee. I feel like that probably is similar to a lot of people. Um, when I first started drinking coffee, it really was just for the taste, but now I probably drink like three to four cups of coffee a day, and I love me some espresso. So for the most part, I for sure was a Starbucks girly when it comes to coffee, um, probably because of its convenience, to be honest with you. Um, based on what's happened in the last month, I am officially on the Boy Park Starbucks bus, and so it is at-home coffee for me. I used to be a pot coffee girl. I've tried the French press. I've tried the pour over, but right now I just have to go with the convenience of an espresso. Um, definitely prefer iced coffee in the morning and then hot coffee for the second part of the day. Okay, my next essential item is my full skincare routine. Can I tell you I take all of this with me everywhere I go? I'm not missing a step. Uh, so fun fact, before I joined uh, the Tilt team, I was the director of operations with Massage Envy Franchise. I really got into skincare and massage therapy. I even went to school for aesthetics for a period of time. Um, absolutely fell in love with taking care of my skin, learning about ingredients. Um, and this is a full like 12 step skincare routine. Everything from the lash cleaner, shout out to my girl Nikki, my lash tech. Um, to cleanser, I don't really use toner, but definitely use eye cream. Definitely use uh, different serums for daytime, nighttime. I have different moisturizers based on how my skin is responding. Um, and then all the way down to uh, lip treatments. Um, also, ladies, don't dry your face with towels. Like there's so much bacteria that lives in towels. Use disposable products. That way it doesn't carry bacteria. Um, and drink water. That makes the world of a difference when it comes to skincare routine. That's probably the only thing that's missing from this table but I'm very proud of this collection. It's taking me a long time to get here for sure. Okay, my next essential item are earrings. When it comes to pretty much any outfit, whether I'm running to the gym, going to the grocery store, um, if it's an event, I really love having a statement piece earring. Um, for me right now, the bigger the earring, the better, and the louder the statement, the better. Um, finding new brands is something that I really enjoy. Right now, the brand that I'm really in love with um, is called Heaven Mayhem. For a long time, I was buying jewelry and earrings from Revolve, which everyone loves Revolve. They have really great brands, but I've been trying to lean more into um, smaller brands and buying from them directly. Um, I also really love silver earrings right now, so leaning into that silver trend, trying to match with other jewelry pieces. Um, working on a jewelry line coming soon. Shout out to my partner. Uh, 2024, we should be launching, so more to come in that category. Okay, my next essential item is a hair clip. Um, for anyone who doesn't know, I am half black, half white. My family is from Guyana. And to all my mixed girls or anyone with curly hair, I know the struggle with keeping your hair straight and wanting it to last the full seven days. That is where my hair, my hair clip comes into play. Um, I wear my hair straight pretty much always. And so not messing with it, taking it out of my face, um, not getting it oily, really the hair clip is what helps me with that. I honestly have a different hair clip to go with like a lot of my different outfits. So this is the one that I happen to have with me today, but I love printed ones, I love big ones, I love um, ones that I can wear my hair like into little puffs. Um, ladies, do your hair. Like I feel like it takes 10 minutes to just do your hair. And if that means having a cute messy bun, that's totally a look. Um, or using the clip can be a look as well. Um, but my hair clip is definitely essential to be able to help me last that full uh, seven days between washes. So my next essential item is DoorDash. Ugh, so embarrassing. I do not cook. It is something that I will get to at some point in life, but for right now, the convenience of having food delivered to me is so important. If I can multitask and do 50 things and have food delivered at the same time, not get hangry, so important to my life. DoorDash is definitely my preferred food vendor. Um, I feel like they just have better options for me right now, uh, but DoorDash, breakfast, lunch, and dinner, baby. 
I will say convenience is not always everything. DoorDash has definitely done me wrong a couple times. Um, I've had my food delivered to the wrong address, like don't even know how they got whatever address it was delivered to. Um, but there was one time that the DoorDash said it was delivered to my front door, went outside, was not at my front door, got a refund for it, but lo and behold, it was like outside of my apartment complex on the curb. That day I got to eat and got a refund, so thank you DoorDash for that, but the convenience for sure doesn't always work out as I want it to. My next essential item is my laptop. I just feel more comfortable if I carry this with me everywhere I go. Um, in my last job, I traveled a lot for work and so my laptop was always with me. Now at Tilt, whether it be inventory management, payroll, um, managing our budget, I just, there's always something that I'm doing and always something that I need to use my laptop for. Okay, so I am absolutely a PC girl. I do not understand how to use Macs. Switching between screens and trying to figure out how to use your Excel on Mac, it it's just makes no sense to me. So absolutely a PC girl. Um, also for me, the bigger the better. This laptop that I use right now is a Lenovo. Everyone makes jokes that it's a TV screen as I carry it around, but it just is so much easier to see Excel sheets on a bigger computer screen for sure. My next essential item are glasses. I feel like glasses are just such a vibe of when it comes to styling outfits. Oftentimes I feel like color can absolutely be a way that you can play with glasses, not just frames, but being able to find like a really unique color to your glasses. Um, right now, my Pradas are my favorite. Um, the black really does go with everything. Um, but also, I think that some glasses frames, like it's important to be able to have wide frames, especially if you go outside a lot. Uh, glasses are also really important to wear while you're driving to be able to help prevent like fine lines and wrinkles around your eyes, ladies. So always wear your glasses. My next essential item are my nails. Uh, I really wear like simple outfits, simple colors. I wear black a lot and so I feel like my nails are really like a way that I express my creativity. I stress out so much about the designs but I really love to always have like a really creative design on my nails. Uh, really for me I think color is what I'm into right now. I went through a chrome phase but the color is where it's at. My next essential item is my phone case. Um, not necessarily for functionality, but I love a very creative phone case design. To be 100% honest, I probably buy a phone case once a month. I like to buy my phone cases based on season, based on trends. Uh, the one I have right now is like a bubble print. It kind of has like a metallic curly finish to it. Um, I just had a, a silver chrome one that had like the pearl um, phone strap holder, which I absolutely love that as well. I look at phone cases as another piece of accessory. Um, ladies, if you're trying to level up, sometimes you gotta think outside the box, and so your phone case can absolutely be an accessory, um, but definitely something that I probably overspend on um, annually than I should. My last essential item is perfume. Um, I think definitely over time in my 20s, I have fallen in love with having a very uh, large collection of perfumes. Shout out to my mans. Um, if you guys know Trey, Trey buys me all of my perfumes. To be 100% honest with you, in the last like six to seven years, this is literally the only perfume that I have bought myself. He is a great gift giver. So right now, um, the perfume that I'm using is the Carolina Herrera. Um, this has absolutely been one that I fell in love with. Trey got me this one for Christmas. Uh, when it comes to perfumes that are more designer, I definitely wear those at night a lot more frequently. Um, ladies, I also don't discriminate on like store brand, like Target brand perfumes. This is Mix Bar. It's a vanilla bourbon. It's absolutely great. My all-time favorite though is the YSL Chef's Kiss. Uh, Trey for Christmas. Thank you guys for watching my 10 essentials. Uh, you can find me on Instagram at gongirl.lex. Also, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe to our YouTube channel, Tilt Los Angeles. We will catch you in store soon.